As of today, the age limit to buy tobacco products in Michigan is 21. Governor Gretchen Whitmer signed a package of bills raising the age from 18. This bringing Michigan in line with the federal requirement. 7 Action News reporter Darren Cunningham has had more on the penalties tobacco shops may face in the public health impact. I spoke with a cardiologist who says anything that can be done to decrease a young person's exposure to tobacco products is a good thing because the earlier a person starts, the harder it is to quit. We've been huge advocates of this for a long time. The legislature has just been behind it. Today, Governor Whitmer signed legislation raising the minimum age a person can buy tobacco from 18 to 21. That's now in sync with the federal age limit. Also, the law stops anyone under 21 years old from setting foot in a tobacco shop and the age limit applies to tobacco sales through the mail. Any store caught selling tobacco products to anyone under 21 would face up to a $100 fine for the first offense, up to $500 for the second time, and up to $2,500 each time after that. Dr. Shrukri David, chair of cardiovascular services for Ascension Michigan says it's about time considering the documented detriment of tobacco use. Having lung cancer and a tracheostomy and a thoracotomy and lung resections or open heart surgery or coronary angioplasties or amputations where you have to use prostheses from, from tobacco use. If that doesn't make the case, in addition to that, David says tobacco use is a leading cause for heart disease, heart attacks, stroke, and vascular disease. A healthier population, I mean, obviously there are other contributors to vascular disease, diabetes, hypertension, uh, obesity, et cetera, uh, but tobacco use is one of those things that's preventable. I spoke with the co-owner of a convenience store that sells tobacco products. He didn't want to go on camera, but he says he thinks a change in the law is a mistake because he says a young person can go off to war at 18, yet they cannot buy tobacco products. He called it unfair. Darren Cunningham, 7. Action News.